Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we are on the Political Machine 2020 once again and as requested we are playing as a Republican on Painful Mode and we are playing as the one and only Thomas Jefferson versus not Joe Biden, George Washington as a Democrat. I think this would be a very very interesting matchup. It's a new ideology, I haven't tried it yet, I don't know what the tree is. But I think it will be very cool to see it. So, yeah. I haven't seen this yet. I'll wait for my first points before I do. I'll just turn this down a little bit. And let's get into this. So, I am a Republican. I need to remember that. I often forget with these uh, older, like these founding father characters. Um, let's go to Colorado. And we want to get a HQ in Michigan as quick as possible. Now let's go to Texas and get that event. I love the ideology points. Even if it is only two. Can I afford anything? No. Give me liberty is the only one I can do. It's like hope and change. They will spread out. I like that. Let's build a HQ in Michigan. And a HQ in Pennsylvania. Just start getting our enthusiasm up in there. Uh, I'll need one in Minnesota soon. And probably Ohio. I think Virginia will be a key battleground state if we can try and win that. We do want to try and keep North Carolina though, so that's got our enthusiasm up in there. I would like Ohio as well and Iowa, they're necessary. Uh, I'm going to have this thing. I hate this. I don't want it to show me it ever. Oh, I wanted to endorse that. No. <coughs> Alright, so give me liberty. Good. We fought so hard to earn our freedom, as long as your wishes don't violate someone else's rights, why would should we let the government restrict us? Very well said. Stronger state government, freedom to worship, agrarianism, Wall Street regulation, investigating political opponents, and Second Amendment rights. So I'm going to go for these two, because they don't give my opponent any enthusiasm, and I do like me some enthusiasm. Right, let's go here. Let's go to Michigan. I'm gonna upgrade that HQ. Good. Right, let's go to the event in Idaho and get that ideology points. Or national enthusiasm is always good, as you'll see. Let's build one in Arizona. I saw him trying for it. Right, so a speech about protecting social security, as that is the top issue. If I can get ahead on some of these other ones as well, which I am at the moment, it will be good let's fly to Ohio again I do want to put a HQ here next turn so that oh a land for all people okay right freedom of worship what's this one maritrial traditions okay right now we'll just go for this one agrarianism I think ours just sort of cancelled each other out there. Right, let's go to Colorado and build. Okay, I can't. Let's go to Minnesota then. Get ahead there. Let's go to Pennsylvania. Expand our lead. And let's go back to Colorado. Alright, now get one in Minnesota as well. And let's fly to Pennsylvania. Let's fly back to Minnesota. And back to Pennsylvania. And uh, we'll see it in Pennsylvania. Good day, yes, of course. I don't want to encourage it much, but I already said, of course, I'm a coward. What do you do? Uh, <laughs> inactive America should be harvested for meat. <laughs> That's brilliant. Um, if we're healthy, are we stronger in this country? I won't interfere with the person of choice. Good. Love these modern video games, uh, the loot boxes. Do we need to put a lead on this? Um, yeah, let's study it. Don't do anything unless it's necessary. Boom! I love that. Absolutely love that. Now I'm going to go for agrarianism next, which I will get now actually. Agrarianism. Uh, what are these? Legal cannabis legalize legalization, maybe. 
yeah, I think I will actually. I do cannabis legalization next. Boom, Florida. Actually contesting Maine, but I am gonna go to Michigan and try to get ahead on some of those issues. What are we at? Uh, we're behind on fixing the roads and COVID. Okay. So let's just get ahead on fixing the roads. And then I'll get ahead on Flint Water Crisis next turn as well. Right, come on, Florida. I just hope that AI doesn't, doesn't spam out agents again. They always just seem to do that, and it really annoys me. Let's go to Nevada, see if we can just get ahead there. And then back to Florida. Good. Oh, he just did a lot. He just made a lot of states red, but then he made New York and that blue. Um, so do Second Amendment rights or legalized cannabis? This is high issue importance, so I think I'll do that. Then I think I'll do uh, Second Amendment rights next. Perfect. Pennsylvania is secured. Let's go to Michigan. Yeah, see, there's already a spin doctor there. Alright, let's stop COVID. Alright, we've got to protect social security. Just to make sure we're ahead on their top issue. Because they're more likely to support that. Right, who are we going to have? I think I'll have the only other Democratic Republican here, which is James Madison. Let's go up here and collect that. Hmm. Do I give him two enthusiasm or do I save up to only give one? I'm going to save up and make sure I only give him one. Because enthusiasm is very bad to give your opponent. Alright, blue collar jobs. Alright, Colorado is now secured. Banning problematic speech. Interesting choice, Washington. Interesting choice. How is it not secured when it's 51% in my favour? It's 51 to 46 with 3% undecided and it's not mine. That makes no sense. Is he ahead on me? He's ahead on me on fixing the roads, kind of that. That was secure. Right, let's go to Florida and protect social security. Then let's go to, can we win? oh, we actually might be able to win Maine here. That would be interesting. All right, let's get these ideology points. Then let's get Second Amendment rights. Boom. Minnesota and Texas, both of which are now secured. He got Elizabeth Warren as his VP. Interesting choice. Alright, let's do fixing the roads again. Good. Are we just. No, I'm just getting ahead on him. Okay. Right. Now let's go to Florida and do. Funding NASA. Good, good, good. Alright, let's get this Massachusetts event. National enthusiasm. I love national enthusiasm. South Carolina and Tennessee are now secured. New Hampshire is competitive, apparently. I'll build a HQ there. Just in case. I'm not really going to try for it, though. May have an Andrew Yang, Texas situation. <laughs> Go check that video out if you haven't already. Hmm. Right, where should I fly? I'll get ahead in uh, Washington. What do the polls say? The polls would say I'd win by 361. Wow. So see, so they support him on COVID, me on cannabis legalization by 100%, him on diversity, him on gun rights, me on united North America, me on stronger federal government, me on religious freedom, him on term limits, that's fair enough, uh, me on all other issues, and the total is in favor of me. Nice.
Let's try and keep it that way. Right, let's go up to New Hampshire. Let's actually address the opioid crisis. I don't think many people will do that. So let's just go up there and say I'll address that. Whether I actually will or not, that's a different question. Right, so I don't actually need Florida. Um, so I'm going to actually focus on Wisconsin and Washington because Florida is just being spammed with agents. So let's see if I can get some good agents here. Operatives. It's the Continental Army. Right, so we just got a smear merchant. Okay, Continental Army wasn't good. Let's get a cheerleader in Pennsylvania. No, New Hampshire. Yeah, New Hampshire. Right, let's see. I think I'll do regulating tech. Okay, that was good, that was good. Right. Nevada should now be locked down. Hawaii is contested apparently. I don't think that's quite right. Right, let's go on the Taco Carson. Deficit's getting ridiculous. Our grandkids are gonna have to end up paying it pay having to pay for all this spending. What are you gonna do? Uh raise taxes or slash spending. Uh, uh good, good, good. A lot of Hollywood celebrities are morons. Uh they annoy me. Thank you. Alright, let's see what happened in my absence. So Pennsylvania is now blue. Okay, what's the poll saying? Poll saying I'd still win. Right, 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 right. Well, winning Virginia, we got Minnesota locked. Um, this is where we need to be strategic. All right, we need to make sure Michigan doesn't flip, and we need Wisconsin not to flip as well. So we need quick increases in enthusiasm. Apparently Connecticut is contested. I don't think that's quite right. Alright, let's get the uh, uh, firing ideology points. Okay, so let's see. Polls. Still winning, but it's narrowing up, and I don't like this. Alright, Wisconsin. What are the top issues? COVID, border protection, renewable energy. Hmm. Right, let's try and get my renewable energy up. Good. Michigan, what's up here? He's winning in COVID. Hawaii shouldn't say it's contested. But I'll fly there anyway. Alright, Nevada, lockdown. Washington, meh. Alright, go back to Wisconsin. I believe, guys, believe. I'll actually win as a Republican for once. Uh, good, good, good. A lot of secured states. I like to see this. Let's just fly to Hawaii again. Right, that's not good. I don't know how that happened. Although, this is good. Hmm. California is up for grabs. I don't... You know what, no. I'm going to spend this turn building HQs in these places just to make sure I don't lose them. I'm playing uh, defense right now. Alright, let's get some. Uh, apparently, cookies and our operatives. Are we winning in Michigan? No. Nor are we winning. I'm just curious. We're winning in Cali. What's the other agent? It's like in me. It's a spin doctor, that's good. 
boom. Although, if I just do this, boom, Kali is safe. I honestly don't think I'll hold on to it. I want to see what happens. I think that's a uh, fixer. Yep. And a smear merchant. Yep. They're gunning for it. Yep, and then they had another fixer as well. Okay, well, that's the end of that. Let's just try and win. So we're up in Missouri. We're up in Iowa. Tied in Michigan. Um, why? I don't know why it says content. Okay, actually, that's close. I'm just gonna. Oh my gosh, Hawaii is even. Okay, Washington, let's go to Maine. Let's tie that out if we can. Alright, so the final exit polls have me at 282 to 256. Election night, baby. Let's do this. Come on, we won Maine. That is good. New Hampshire as well. That is very good. I don't think I even tried for Pennsylvania in the end. No. I didn't really. I gave up on Florida as well. Well, that was still close, so that's alright. We actually won the popular vote. That's interesting. Republicans winning the popular vote. Come on. Okay, we didn't win Michigan. That isn't good. Come on, Wisconsin. Good. Right, we're going to need to pick up Louisiana, Missouri, and Iowa. Come on, Missouri. Come on, Iowa. Good. Right. Mi mi Minnesota, good. Good. I need all of these to go to me now because I didn't get Michigan. I need Hawaii, I think. Or do I? I think I do. No, we got the presidency. Oh, thank gosh. My maths was very bad there. I'm sorry. But we picked up Nevada. We didn't pick up Washington. We didn't pick up Oregon or Cali. Small attempt at the end. Hawaii? No, not Hawaii either. However, the final polls bring us in at 286 to 252. Wow, wow, wow. What an election, ladies and gentlemen. So, winning the home state of both of us, uh, Virginia, was very, very good. Winning Maine was surprising. I won it by less than a percent. It wasn't even the toss-up, apparently. Cali, not bad. We won the popular vote by 2 million votes. We lost Hawaii by less than a percent. We lost Michigan by less than a percent. It's not too bad all around. So... I actually won as a Republican, I'm happy about that. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. This is the final election results of Thomas Jefferson winning the White House. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Please tell me any further um, any further matchups you'd like to see. I'm willing to make characters as well. But thank you guys so much for watching. Take care and goodbye.